this video is about J Center Mall no more. I'm here right now in J Center Mall. This mall has opened last November 11, 2011. And the sad news now is this mall is closing down. As of the moment, they're only until the 31st of January. But you know, the other businesses here like Toyoko Inn and the J Center, a J condo had their own access in the front for Toyoko Inn and then the J condo will be on the back they still continue business as usual but anyway it's just the ownership of the entire facility has changed this is now owned by SM Holdings so this is gonna be one of the SM malls soon as you know, SM Hypermarket is already existing and operating here since the start. So over a decade, this mall has existed. Like I said, it opened last November 11, 2011. And now it's closing its door January 31st, 2023. So... You will have your last look of the J Center High Days. You can also check on my J Center Mall videos where you can see that it was still operating before and they're in, the, in its hype, you know, when there's a lot of shops still open. So most of the restaurant left side, right side are already closed down. Elevators are not operating anymore. And food kiosks attorney are still existing until the end of the month. But 90% of the businesses here, especially the immigration is not here anymore. Oh, I see that there's an escalator working there. That's the dessert factory still existing. Now, there. We'll continue to serve you until January 31st, 2023. And that's what the order that they will be closed down properly for renovation for the new owner, which is going to be the SM city malls sm holdings so most shops have closed the kiosks are the one existing the hypermarket since it's owned by sm and all the sm companies like miniso ace hardware are still existing and they will continue to be operating there and the place where they are until it's reopened again under the new management which is the SM like the hypermarket will still continue to be there but that's one thing Watson's will also be continuing here since Watson's is owned by SM Com group of companies Ace Hardware of course is owned by SM group of companies but it's still renovating so very sad but it might be for the better because you know how grandiose how elaborate SM is with their malls so the J Tower is a residences but they are located here on the back of the J Center. So it will still continue to be built, which is, you can see that it's now rising up from the ground.
So the land transportation office in the food court is still there. But this is what's happening right now. This is what's left. A lot of companies are already taking out their stocks, closed down their doors earlier than usual. This uh, me and uh, Mr. DIY has long been closed. Opticals, um, even the outside restaurants, only a few is open, but 90% is already done. I mean, already left before this stage, even last year. The food court still exists because there are people still coming here, availing of the services and the shops. The services LTO, Pag Ibig is still existing here. So you still can see the food court is still existing. But like I said, 90% also already done. Done closing down. Look, LTO, because it's Saturday. It's closed, but they are open here until the end of the month. So if you want to see the glorious days of J Center Mall, just check it in my blog. I already had videos of the highlight of J Center Mall on its high days. So, Pag Ibig Fun is still existing, and then most on the back is already closed. These are the shops, clothes shops, shoe shop, still exist until now, and closing its door at the end of the month. What's funny because they are not on sale, that they should be selling it. Uh, like a closing down sale. Wala gi mo mag-sale, madam. Huh? Isa ka mo mo kuan. Si girl don't know how to do sales. So Ito na to sa mga restaurant sa Luyuk. Ga. Hmm. So second, next floor down. I was telling Sen that we'll check out the restaurants on the back. Because it's quite a nice place on the back. So escalators that are working are here on the front. There's only one here. This one you have to get down manually now. But from the parking area, going up here, it's all closed down because there's no point. And there's also toilets are limited to certain areas. Like the food court toilet is non-existing anymore. It's closed down, renovated. So they're hoping to open this up again before the next holidays. This is the left to Bari now. Oh, now I know where they're gonna move. Asa mo mamalhin in after here. Where else, mom? Sa? Sa Tingson Village, Skina, Akbang, Nai Petron. Luyo yun sa Petron. Luyo sa Petron. Ato na mo. Nana mo di turon wapa. Ah? Awas ah. Because you know, I was asking her because this is where I buy 
some of my clothes, some of Old Beast clothes because they are original from a exported items made in the Philippines and they are just export overruns. Like I have featured in my video, left to Bari, you can buy the same color, the same size, like two or three, ten times more. You know, the same color of one pile, the same size one pile. But the prices are really good. So they are now Singson Village at Bang Petron Loyo. So I will feature you for people that's looking for a left to Bari when I feature it. I don't even know myself. I just known it now that they are across Mandawi Highway, across the Singson Village. There's a Petron station behind the Petron station. I will visit there and feature it so you will know. in God's time, Madam, I apostrophe sa before sa S, no? Dapat to? Oh. Yeah. Uh, sa D. So that's the J Center condo. It's still being built because it's on a different way. The one that's owned by SM is the building of the J Center. So you can see the restaurants on the back have already closed down except for one. Oh no, none existing at all. There is no more restaurants around here. Hopefully, this is going to be beautified by SM, so it looks better. That's one good thing about here in the back. It's really windy, although your view is the city view of Mandawa City. But the breeze-wise, it is quite breezy. So until January 31st, 2023, and there is no more immigration office here. It is in Robinson's Galleria. over here so there's still the Visayan Electric Company office but here the immigration is closed So, this is it. J Center Mall, no more. 2023.